In this video, I will be going over the directions for the assignment that you will find on the next page of the playlist. Please make sure and watch this video entirely before you move on to that assignment. I thought rather than write a ton of text, directions that you'd have to read, I would just record the directions. As you're watching this, please pay close attention and when you're done, if there are any questions that you have that were not answered in the video, then of course, please reach out and I'll help you with that. And as usual, feel free to pause this video or rewind it as many times as you need to. Okay. So here's the assignment. This is what you'll see when you open the next page of the playlist. Examples of modification research project. So. You may work on this in groups of no more than three of your classmates. Again, I want to stress that you can work with a partner or you can work with two partners, but you may not work with any more than that. So please don't ask. Groups of three total. If you choose to work on it by yourself, obviously that's completely okay too. They may not be from other classes. However, each person must complete their own worksheet and submit it to its learning. Again, if you're working in a group of three, the three of you can have exactly the same answers, but each of you has to submit your own answers to its learning. If you work in a group, please put the first and last names of everyone in the group at the top of the graphic organizer. You'll see there's a spot right here. If you're working by yourself, you don't need to worry about it. If you're going to work with a partner or two partners, please each of you put all the names of the people in the group right here. For this assignment, you will be brainstorming and using what you've learned to describe ways people have modified the Earth throughout history. Brainstorming, if you haven't heard that term before, all it means is thinking about. You're going to be really thinking about ideas that you might have on ways people have modified the earth or the ways that people are modifying the earth. Brainstorming is a really nice idea. It just means actively thinking about ideas and coming up with ideas. And, and again, what you're going to be doing is using what you've learned and brainstorming ways that people may have modified the earth throughout history or are currently modifying the earth. Please do not use the examples that I went over in class. So in other words, the development of New York City, the Chesapeake Bay Bridge Tunnel, please don't use those, but anything else should be good. Important to receive full credit. All responses must be in complete sentences. Let me go over that again. I've got it in bold, italicized, and underlined. In order to receive full credit, you must answer in complete sentences. Okay. So here's your graphic organizer. What you're going to do is um, you're going to use the internet. You can do a Google search if you want to. Um, again, if you're working with partners, you can have them uh, work on different things, different internet searches. You can even get your parents or maybe brothers or sisters, aunts and uncles to help you with this. I do not mind that at all. But what you're going to be doing is using the internet to find examples either current or past, of ways that people have modified the earth so they can survive and so they can have an easier life. You're just going to go into the internet and you're going to start searching that. I'm not giving you specific search terms. This is where the brainstorming comes in. You're going to have to think how might be some ways that people have modified the earth. Uh, we've done a lot of work with this and I think I've given you some really good examples but you're going to have to come up with these kind of on your own based on what you've learned based on any brainstorming you can do how are ways currently or throughout history that people have modified the earth to make life better once you do find examples of that examples current or past of how people have modified the earth you're going to copy and paste the URL, the address of the website, right in here. Copy and paste it. Then you're going to put down the year or the date the modification took place. These are pretty easy. And then here's where I'm really going to be looking. In your own words, provide a description of how people have modified the Earth's characteristics. 
again, this is what I'm going to be really looking at. I'm going to check your source and I'm going to look in your own words how you describe these events. How did people modify the earth? You're going to give five different examples. I will ask you um, to, if you find a website that you really like, you can only use one website three times. So if you find a website that has a really good example or a bunch of really good examples of this, you can use that website here, here, and here. But for the last two, you have to have different websites. Or, of course, what I would really like is if you have different websites. This is research. This is our first research project of the year. Um, so we'll talk more about how you can do research, but I want to see what you can do on your own. Again, this is what I'm going to be looking at. If you are not sure if you're doing this correctly, I'm not going to require this, but I am going to highly recommend this. Once you have one of these rows filled in, I would recommend that you stop and you reach out to me and say, Mr. Bain, take a look at this. Am I on the right track? Again, I'm not going to require it, but I'm going to highly recommend it. You can, if we're, if we're in class, you can you say, Mr. Bain, you can take a look at this. Um, if tomorrow um, or whenever you do have a sync, uh, an asynchronous lesson, in other words, if we're not in class, that would be on Friday, um, you can just shoot me an email asking if this is okay. That's what I would recommend. If you have any questions that were not answered in the video, please reach out. Again, pause, rewind, watch it as many times as uh, you feel necessary. And when you're ready, proceed to the next page in the playlist where you can open this assignment and get started on it.